Welcome to another Stamp with Cynthia video. Today I'd like to show you a really simple trick that might save you a lot of headache in future. If you're like me, one of your favorite adhesives is the Stamping Up Snail. Fantastic two-sided tape that is really, really adhesive, sticks well, easy to use, and really fast. However, the problem comes when you've got small elements. Let me show you what I mean. Just for visual effect, I'll use the black underneath. Now, when you have a small element and you're trying to use the snail, invariably you run off the edge of your element and you leave this sticky bit behind. You can hear how tacky that is. Turns out that whenever you're working, whatever you put down on top of your surface ends up sticking to it. That's no fun. So let me show you what you can do to prevent that. Stamping up dimensionals are the single best dimensionals on the market, but in addition to be, them being fantastic dimensionals, they have another wonderful quality. The paper that the dimensionals come on. When you're finished your dimensionals, do not throw this away. Save that sheet, the waxy sheet the dimensionals came on, and use it as your working surface. When you're trying to get tape onto small elements, you can actually roll your snail all the way off your small piece right onto this backing paper and yet there is no snail on here. The adhesive rolls right up onto your cut piece and now it's available to put on your project exactly where you would like it. No extra sticky pieces, nothing sticking here, nothing sticking here. So remember, when you're finished with your dimensionals, don't throw the backing away. Use the backing as a work surface so that you can roll snail without leaving stickiness behind. I hope you enjoyed this short video that shows you how to use the backing paper from dimensionals to keep your work surface clean and non-sticky. If you have any stamping up materials and products that you would like to order, please feel free to contact me. My blog is www.stampwithcynthia.blogspot.com. You can place your orders through that site or ask me any questions you'd like. Thank you so much for joining me today. Have a lovely afternoon and God bless.